Well, the Godolphin Group ended its Melbourne Cup drought with yesterday's win. But 19 years ago, a horse called Rogan Josh thwarted their efforts. Amazingly, he's still around and going well at 26. Today, he was reunited with a very special partner in crime. A Darwin school teacher and a gelding who didn't sell at auction doesn't sound like a powerful pair. But together, Wendy Green and Rogan Josh made history. Do you know what it is? Do you remember? Wendy is reliving one of the greatest fairy tales in our great race. She bought Rogan Josh for just $7,000. The family hack stormed home to claim the 1999 Melbourne Cup. Rogan Josh wins at nearly a length. Legendary trainer Bart Cummings said he was taking Wendy on a magical ride. He called me Wendy in Wonderland. He said, I've never had an owner that's had no idea about racing. I've never had an owner that's got one horse and believes that it's going to win a Melbourne Cup. Sheikh Mohammed Central Park finished second in that race. And he said to me on the day, you will never win another one. And I said to him, matey, I don't have to, you do. After cruising down from Sydney on board the Carnival Spirit, Wendy was trackside yesterday to see the Sheikh's Godolphin stable claim its first win. I just remember he's had 700 horses every year in work to choose from, you know, and I had one. And it's that whole story of the Melbourne Cup. You can't buy a Melbourne Cup. The Melbourne Cup Cup chooses you. Rogan Josh is now 26. He's been here at the Living Legends Farm for 12 years and will spend the rest of his days in this paddock being spoilt by thousands of visitors. But none will be as special as Wendy. I'm a bit sort of in awe of you, aren't I? And I'm the keeper of your cup. Annie Kearney for 10 News First.